B, thank you. And the city of El Paso funding more than 4,000 overtime hours for U.S. Customs and Border Protection officers. That's according to our media partners at Border Report. Now, this was in the last calendar quarter of 2022 through its public-private partnership program with the federal government. The overtime is typically applied during peak traffic hours at international bridges. In addition, the program paid for more than 2,400 El Paso police officers overtime during the same period, helping prevent traffic tie-ups on roads going to Mexico or feeding bridge traffic to El Paso highways and freeways.